I'm sorry. You're safe now. It's okay. My boy. Forgive me, Manny. My money. Your money? Come on. Let's go. It's over. Dear 47, if you read this letter, I am most likely dead. You will have shot me for a traitor, and Travis will have won. Do not let him have the girl as well. Travis's division was conducting genetic experiments without the agency's knowledge, and Victoria was their crowning achievement. Give her the choice you never had. Protect Victoria. And kill Benjamin Travis. Kill Benjamin Travis! This is the epilogue. I didn't even know. I thought this was gonna be like the final. Well, it is a final mission, but it's an epilogue. Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen, bitches. We are here to record from the mo I, I fucked up. We're here to finish Hitman Out Solution. That's what we're here to do. Uh, this is the final episode, um, and that's that. Then we're done with this. I got one more episode with Batman basically prolonging that. And then we have space to start three new walkthroughs from scratch. I know what they're going to be for the most part, uh, but you guys are just going to have to wait and see. That's how, that's just how it goes. Let's jump in and let's All get this done. Have been escorted from the premises. We have the place to ourselves. So we have to kill. Is the line secure? Go ahead. We've located the Burnwood family gravesite. We have to kill Benjamin Very Button. Well. Proceed with the exhumation. He gave Honestly, me a sniper. To find. Our investigation okay. Diana Burnwood died that day. We have the police and autopsy reports. 47 himself Can confirmed. I put that so shit away. What more do you want? We've underestimated 47 more than once. No, I don't buy it. Burnwood is more than capable of faking her own death. She could outsmart you in a heartbeat. I'm gonna take this guy. I was gonna let him live, but nah, we need we. I mean, why why not take his outfit? The thing is, do I have a sniper on this? Absolutely, I like that. Okay, so I have a feeling this is the final mission. I have a feeling that this is gonna be the type of mission that needs to kick off in some way or another. Or maybe not needs to, but we going we gon' make it. So let everybody go about do their own thing. What? I didn't mean to do that. Command, checking area, possible disturbance. Oh, Lord Jesus. Hey there. Hello? Shut that shit up. <laughs> Alright. Nobody sees a thing. Oh, we got a big weapon over there as well. Do I have to swap that for the sniper or can I carry both? From my experience... You can't carry both. Right, we ain't even gonna hide this buddy because I don't see any way to do it. But we'll be okay. Is that another set? No, that's just dark. That's just darkness. We could probably hide this buddy right there. Can I snatch that and have the I cap <laughs> On to the T! Alright, let's move this just because we've seen in previous missions where we will not hide a body. And then like three, four segments later, when we thought we were good, somebody discovers a body. I don't know if we can actually hide him there. It's little, look, at, look at his feet. <laughs> oh, you have to pull him all the way out just to grab... Oh! There we go, there we go, there we go. Hidden in the darkness. <laughs> Alright, we're good. So as always, we're still gonna... Still gonna keep this stealthy. Even when close. Because as I've explained already, if you, you, you get close to them... 
they'll they'll like they'll mention it'll be like why why are you crouching you are you're acting weird but they won't actually do anything about it until they actually get like a clear sight on you let me put my gun away as well for that i was gonna move right there but we got two people coming up down the middle might be safer to go around the left hand side but for now Ah, if this dude wasn't coming through the middle right here, I would have made my move. I can actually do it right now, to be honest with you. I know him. I don't think I have enough instinct for this. Yeah, we just about did it. And they didn't get suspicious. I mean, they saw me. And they thought, what the hell is this guy doing? But nobody actually reached the level of suspicion. So where are we actually heading to? Right over there. It might, it might have been better for us to go down the left hand side. But we've made our decision. We've made our bed. Now we have to lay. Alright, what are we looking at? What are we looking at? All of this, like, like, guys, this, 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 recording this series takes patience amongst everything else. Like, all of this just to get indoors in the first place, just to start the mission, basically. Three people coming down the middle again. I'm thinking I could cut through this left side. Might be a little bit risky. Can't be any more risky than going around the right side, though, to be honest with you. Right side's looking a little bit, uh... Right side's looking a little bit crazy. See what I'm saying? Like, that... See, see what I'm saying? Like, they get a look on you. Shut up. They get, a, they get an eye on you, but it don't matter. Like, nobody... Comes to check. That's this isn't the best position ever for me to be in. See what I'm saying? Like he's suspicious, but he's just like, hey. God damn it, Craig! Please, sir, behave in an orderly fashion. I am behaving in. A I didn't even see my guy right there, bro. Stop that. Everybody leave me alone, man. Everybody leave me alone. I right, they're moving. Great. Like I'm gonna have to move with them or something. Oh my goodness. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. And at this point, I don't know if a brick is gonna work, man. Hey, man, go back over there. What? Go do something. Man, things are being thrown by some joker. We'll look into it. Over. Okay, now you up here turn back around. This has not been clean funny? whatsoever. Well, but at the end out. of the day, I'm making the most out of the mechanics given to me. Man, I didn't even see you there. Like Stop this that. is this is this Stand is wild. Up. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm fucked. How do you get through this? Yes, How's how's, how's this i just have to make sure that they don't see me long enough like they see me i just need to make sure they don't see me long enough they see me long enough they definitely see me long enough oh my goodness <laughs> oh my goodness there's somewhere if i take this dude out i can hide his booty matter of fact if i take him out somebody's absolutely gonna see it as long as he keeps his back over here We'll be okay. Oh my god, I don't know how I got through that. They see it. If that was on hard difficulty, it would have never happened. It would have never went down like that. You, sir, need to move from the door. It's, it's, if he keeps looking over there, we're absolutely fine. He turns even for a second. We might be in trouble. I hope we don't have to pick this lock. Like, can we just go through the door, please? Please. No, we have to pick the lock. Don't turn around. Keep looking at our wall. We got it. Light work. It wasn't light work at all. <laughs> shit was too hard. Shit, crazy. Lied about operation. And 
when they hear you pooled these kind of resources to close down a cemetery, they're going to start demanding answers. Who so is Jade? Burnwood went rogue, your little science project, everything could get exposed. I'm not going down because you're obsessed with a dead woman. Management will believe what I tell them to believe. It oh, uh, you going like that? Eggs. Well, this is your chance. Get it done or start writing up your own. Said management will believe what I tell them to believe. <laughs> is it like, you going like that, huh? So. So I'm going to have to come back this way to exit. Hey, look, look, look at me, though. Look at me, though. I'm not worried. I'm not worried about a little gunfight. More than happy to engage. If necessary. Man, Garrett Wire. Should have used the Garrett Wire. I forgot the mechanics of the game. I needed the Garrett Wire, but it worked. It worked. In the end. Should I just drop him in a bush? Is that going to work? I don't really know. I mean... Don't really seem like many people are going to come back around this way anyway. And to be honest, I don't think I'm going to come around this way. I need to go back down the other way. The other way seems safer. This way seems like all kinds of madness. Again, like I said before, I'm going to try and get this all done into one episode. But I don't, I don't, I don't know if that's going to be... Possibly. Anywhere to hide this body? I don't know. That was just a walking, breathing bullseye. I don't know if there is. In the day, there has to be, because I need it. So we gotta find one. I don't care if they find the damn bodies. If you find the bodies, come find me. What's the hold up, Jade? Talk this shit out. It'll be up and running in a minute. See that it does. I just realized that my objective is like right the around here. It's like, oh, oh, okay. I completely forgot I meant to be killing this bitch. to open fire on anyone who approaches. Forty-seven knows better than to make an appearance. Oh, you're a dumb hoe. And what am I, bait? Targets in camouflage. Keep your eyes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, bro. I can't believe it. I missed it. <laughs> oh my god, she dead though. I completely forgot that my target was to kill a bitch, man. I could have done that nicely. Had a sniper. I should have still done it nicely, but I butchered it. I still have a full instinct though. And we got out of there. I missed like four shots from point blank range. We have three bitches to take down. And then I'm sure we're going to have another one afterwards. Because we got to kill, what's his name? Bruce? Brian? Are you kidding? Oh my goodness! <laughs> we got this. I didn't even see. I wasn't prepared for such events. Travis to Praetorians. We are on high alert. Close ranks and shoot anyone who approaches. If you really are the best, this is the time to Essentially, I ain't even trying. Oh, I don't necessarily want to get close to them. Like, I got a sniper. 
I just want to get high ground. Crazy thing is, like, why is it disappeared? What? I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> I almost died again. So they, they, they're not always visible. Like, they kind of... The lasers don't always stay visible. I guess, like, it kind of seems from certain angles you'll be able to see it. From certain angles you won't. Bye. Never mind. Bye. Oh my! I've never been able to use a sniper. I can't. Oh my god. What gun is this? Is this a shotgun? Shotgun is no use to me right now. This isn't a shotgun. Oh, it is a shotgun. Oh my goodness. They don't see me change cover. They won't know where I am. I had, there we go, I had perfect opportunities. How do you hold your breath? There you go, don't worry boy, I got, I got. These two. Wherever they try and hide. I got them. I got, I got both of you. You ain't got shit. Oh my god, I can't get around my own. Oh shit, that's perfect. You keep hunting. Happy hunting! Okay, he, if he is he behind or in front of that wall? Okay. See, you gonna tell me that now, but not when I actually needed it. That's crazy. That's crazy to me. Mhm. Mm Someone check that out. Go, go check that out. Be a dumb motherfucker and check that shit out. Yeah. Yeah. Who's next? Crazy thing is. For all my lack of sniper skill, I can't wait to play Sniper Elite on the channel. Hey. Okay, it slows it down. I was trying to do the steady uh, aim. I missed! I only have two more snipe. Man, fuck it. You, you're, you're holding this pistol. This this pistol L. You have to. That's all I have left. Come on, man. We don't even need you. You have no other role to fulfill on the channel. Just go. Come on. Let's get some. You still ain't dead? Still ain't dead. Still, still ain't. Still, still ain't dead! Oh, this is bullshit! Oh my goodness! Golly, he has the most amazing. I say he amazing. He has the most incredible armor of all time. Is that even possible? Oh my god. He just absorbed a whole plethora of ammunition. Damn, they got the they got the bombs up here too? Give me that evidence. I'll take all the evidence I can get. Alright, still have full instinct. Explosives? Absolutely. 
Deal with Benjamin Trap is wow 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 wow. Hi, my guy Trav. What's up? This is a personal contract. Like that? Yeah, never know. Blah 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 blah. Diana. Do what you have to do. I can help you find them. For a price, of course. So that is it <coughs> for Hitman Absolution. Time for me to do a little quick roundup, a little quick review of what I thought of the game. And if I feel like it's worth a play. I mean, when we do the reviews... We always have to kind of take a different approach, to, depending on whether they're a new game or an old game, classic game. For, for, for reasons like, obviously, you kind of have to rate a game differently, an old game compared to a new game, because you kind of have to rate it based on how it would have stood up back when it was released. So old games obviously aren't going to be as good as new games. They're obviously not going to have the same graphics. They're not going to have the same mechanics in general. Uh, and also, in fact, on top of that, uh, when it comes to whether you should buy it like a lot of the time I, I base my opinion on whether you should buy it on whether it's worth the money This is obviously gonna be a lot cheaper. You can pick this up for a small price nowadays uh, As a whole overall graphically, I mean graphically never really mattered in the hitman series like it's 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 not the forefront it, it, It's always it's always on the back burner graphically. It's all right. You know, it stands up. The cutscenes were nice. You know, um, the cutscenes a little bit different the way they done this one to other Hitman games. I actually do like the idea that they had had an actual story, and they followed the story, and it actually it actually had a purpose. You know, they had missions. It was almost like playing an old school Splinter Cell game. Well, not old school, old school, but almost almost like playing a, a or, or a Metal Gear Solid game where they drop you into a mission. It's not open world. It's not anything like that. Which obviously none of the Hitman games are ever open world, but I mean. I, you understand what I'm saying, kind of, I guess, a little bit. Usually the Hitman games are just mission, like this, contracts, just mission, mission, mission. They never really have a story that's flushed out with cutscenes and stuff. They usually give you a debriefing before each mission, but I like the idea they've done this a little bit differently. The story itself was, it, again, it was all right. It was, it, was pre, it was pretty good. I did enjoy it for the fact that I never really got invested in it by the same time I still was able to enjoy it and enjoy the characters and 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 enjoy waiting to see what was gonna happen next story was alright it wasn't great wasn't bad it was there and again I like the fact that it had a story I always prefer a game to have a story than not have a story that's just the way I am uh, so I, I do like that idea gameplay 
is it's weird. Like at the same time, again, I I don't feel like gameplay is ever a focus in Hitman games. But it's weird to say that because for, if for gameplay to not be the focus and graphics not be the focus, it, it, it focuses a lot more on freedom. Like you have the freedom to kill someone however you want to kill them, whether you want to poison them or or whatnot. I I didn't feel like I had as much in this one. It's probably down to me that I didn't explore as much. I kind of just went straight for the objectives as it was. But I didn't see many, like, I didn't see much rat poison lying around or syringes or just different ways i don't know again i probably didn't explore we'll probably see more of that in the contracts part of the game i don't know but i always felt like it just came down to locating the person and shooting them in the head that's how i did it at least like, you know uh but again that might just be me so i'm not gonna bash the game for that because it probably is just me not being a hitman guy and not taking the time to actually look for those different ways to kill people um also, like, shooting in general, I can't even put my finger on what it is. I can't pinpoint it. It just is bad. It's bad. Maybe I needed to put sensitivity up. I don't know. But it seems like the, the reticle starts off slow and then just starts flying around. It never really... I don't know. It just seems hard to get the reticle locked onto, like, the headshot or something. And then when, if you don't shoot them in the head, they're going to eat, like, four bullets anyway. Uh, shooting is just generally bad. Another thing that I really dislike, and I've mentioned this before, I dislike this in any stealth game. Any stealth game at all. And this is meant to be like the kingpin of... I say kingpin. The kingpin of stealth games other than like Splinter Cell and Metal Gear. Uh, this is meant to be the top. It's solely focused on stealth. I don't like the idea that AI will always know where you are if you make any kind of noise. In a game like Splinter Cell, if I shoot someone in the head, let's not say shoot someone in the head. In a game like Splinter Cell, if 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 I what what type of what type of noise? If anything happens where say I get I get a uh, what's the, detective? Say I get detected. I'm at the back of the map. I draw. I lure one guy to me. I, I I get detected. He sees me. I shoot him in the head. Now he's seen me, everyone knows where I am, for whatever reason. Everyone comes running towards me. Even people down on the other side of the room know exactly where I am just because this one guy see me. It shouldn't work like that. That's how, that used to be the case in like Far Cry, I don't know about the new Far Cry games because I haven't played them. Like Far Cry 4, I think had that problem. I think Far Cry 3 too, like... It's, re it's really annoying. Like, someone sees you for a split second and everybody comes running. Everybody. It, you, it's not even like you they announce it on, on a radio or something. That would be fine if I gave them time to announce it and say, Hey, there's someone over here, uh, third floor. It happens. It doesn't happen all the time in this, but it happens enough for it to be annoying. Where people in other rooms are gonna are gonna come running. And that's something that I, I, never, I never like. Uh... So, so that that really gets someone else. Uh, so really, everything that I've touched on, it's kind of like good but not great. It's all right. It's all right, but not great. Is it worth the money? Again, nowadays you can pick this game up for real cheap. So why not? I mean, especially if you're a Hitman fan and you for some reason never played this one. If you want it, if you're a stealth fan, if you're, a, I wouldn't necessarily recommend. I mean, it it it, it is. It does have some very good elements of stuff, especially at times where you really have to put your brain to it. But at the same time, this game is really difficult, man. Really difficult. Like, I, I even after I took the difficulty off hard, I still find myself in situations where I'm like, I, I can't get through here without taking somebody out or, or getting a disguise. Like, I can't do it. Of course, there is going to be a way. I, I've seen people do it on purists. But it is, it is hard. Um, but yeah, I mean, you can pick this game up for probably like <laughs> three to five pounds, to be honest, man. Like, it's it's not gonna it's not gonna hurt you to pick it up and give it a try if you want to. So, uh, uh, it is what it is. Uh, and give it a go. I guess there's a story there for you to run through. But um, if you want to try the contracts, that's another thing. Uh, but that's it, really. Uh, I would I would give it. I give it a 7 out of 10. 
Yeah, I, I give it. I give it a seven out of ten, and I could sit there. I feel pretty. I feel pretty pretty good with giving it a seven. I think that's. I think that's deserved. Not too harsh. Not too 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 good. But uh, that's it for Hitman Absolution. We're gonna wrap this one up. That's gonna be the last video you see of this on this channel. I'm gonna record another Batman episode, which will be more side missions, and then after that. We'll do the final Batman mission. So, like I said, we'll have no walkthroughs going. At a moment in time of recording this, uh, I am, uh, I'm having network issues. Uh, so, as you guys would have noticed, uploads are a little bit slower. I have decided to kind of just take it easy for the next couple weeks until, like, Devil May Cry comes out and stuff. Um, and just chill while, while we've got these issues. But... I will be trying to get videos up for you guys. They will just be a little bit slower. So, until then, next War for Assassin's Creed will be one of them. Devil May Cry will be one of them. And then the other one, you're going to have to wait. Maybe the, next, maybe the next one I'll put up to a vote. We'll see how that goes. I'll leave that. Uh, maybe I'll do that. So, for now, love each and every one of you. Thank you for passing by. I hope you enjoyed this walkthrough, man. Love you all. Peace.